we think of kind of the French discovery of, of Maine being, you know, Champlain in 1604 in St. Croix, but as we look more and more into archives in Europe and the Wabanaki stories themselves, we recognize that there had been especially fishermen coming to this place for 100 years by that point. For example, the Basque country, French, Spanish, English uh, fishermen that were coming over here to fish for cod. And there aren't really good records for that because they actually weren't sharing the information of where they were finding these incredible cod stocks because it was a huge economic resource and they didn't want to share. One of the things that I think is really fascinating is that some recent research done by Basque scholars has uncovered Passamaquoddy words in Basque that date back to the 1500s. And there have been several um, words in Passamaquoddy that, that they've discovered to have Basque derivations. So when Champlain arrived, the Wabanaki were able to interact and, and speak some French because they had been interacting with French and Basque fishermen for 100 years or more. I also expect that because the Wabanaki were people who already spoke multiple languages because of their existing interactions with other tribal groups for thousands of years, that for them another language was just something you did for the relations.